Welcome to Tech Brother the Dhamir. In this video, we are going to learn about a limit operator or take operator in a custom. Uh, these operators return uh, up to the specified number of rows. Uh, there is no guarantee which records will be returned uh, unless the order by is the used. Uh, so these uh, can return you random records. Uh, so if you are uh, using a limit operator or take operator, don't think it's gonna give you some sorted uh, output. Uh, so you, if you want to get uh, some specified uh, sorted output uh, that you would like to use, uh, then sort operator with it. Uh, so let's go ahead and take a look. Uh, here uh, is my total, uh, total sale table and it has uh, some records here. So let me show you the records uh, first. So we will select our table and it is gonna return us uh, all the records uh, from uh, total sale table. Okay, our records are returned here and now sometime uh, if you have uh, millions of records, uh, maybe uh, you don't want to run uh, this uh, statement uh, right there. So you will select a table and execute. Uh, you don't want to do that. Uh, in those cases, uh, what you would like to do, maybe you want to get some sample data or even just see the uh, how the data is uh, uh, provided. So you just want to take a few records. Uh, you can use them um, with, with limit and then uh, the number of records you would like to return. Uh. So here after the pi uh, table, uh, you will use a pipe sign uh, and then use the uh, limit and then provide the number of rows uh, you would like to return. Uh. In our case, uh, we are returning only five records. Uh. Now this uh, can be on two lines or this can be on single line, doesn't really matter. So Kusto doesn't care about that part. Uh, it's gonna return you the five records uh, from the total sale. Uh. Now, if uh, we would like to do uh, some order by, because uh, we are interested to see the records uh, by the ID, so I can use that uh, total sale, order by ID ascending, uh, and then uh, once you run this one, uh, return me five records. Uh. So see right there, I just ran this part of it, uh, so it is uh, uh, ordering the by the ID, and then uh, if I run together, it's gonna get me only the five records. Uh. So you see right there, now it's gonna get me top five records, uh, okay? Now, what's going to happen here, uh, if uh, you can want to use, uh, instead of limit, you can use take, that will do the pretty much the same thing, uh, and uh, you will say a total sale, and a dollar, uh, your pipe sign, take, and number of records. Um, in this case, we are returning five records again, uh, so you can change to six if you want, or seven, and then uh, again, if you want to have uh, sorted uh, data, so first of all, uh, sort that data, according to the columns whatever you want to sort and then uh, take five records uh, you know or ten records whatever you want to take uh, in this case uh, i'm sorting by order ascending uh, so sorry sorting by id ascending and then taking five out of that uh, so you can use a uh, limit or take uh, no big deal so you see right there five records are returned but uh, they are sorted by id first uh, now if you want to see uh, you have some other columns such as the sale person first name and you want to sort this descending and then get the records that's possible as well so you can see right there sale person first name you just sorted and then you can take five out of that so this is how you, this data will be returned to you so i hope this video is help and you learn how to use the uh, take and limit operators in Kusto to get us um, a small amount of data from your result set. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe my channel and I will see you guys in next video.